Hey guys, how's it all gone? Well, I'm out fishing, obviously, and I'm on the pier. Um, I wasn't even going to come fishing today. I had loads of things to do. But as per usual, I wake up, have a coffee, have a bit of toast. Before you know it, I'm loading up Wander. <laughs> I get the bug for fishing every morning. Um, I wasn't going to come on the pier. I was actually going to go up by the light lighthouse or around the bend, that sort of area. Because in the past week, there's been a few bass coming out. Two or three pound. But uh, the tide's all wrong. We're at high. It's now on the way down. No good on the river. Not in that area anyway. Uh, so I come on the pier. Uh, got two Shakespeare salts. I've got... Um, well, this is a big ass boat. Just got the salute from a couple of guys. Um, wonder if they're subscribers. <laughs> uh, yes, yeah, so I'm on the pair. I've got two Shakespeare salts. Uh, Running ledger, one hook rigs I've made up. I uh, brought some ragworm today. I've just cast out rag tip with squid and uh, we'll see how we go. So I'm just gonna settle in. The weather's nice. There's no wind by this building here. Um, sea is calm. I'm calm. Let's hope there's some fish about. Be nice to catch my first bass. I never do very well on the pier for bass. Apart from the, the odd schoolie here and there. Uh, but you never know. I've heard also that the smooth hounds have moved in over Yarmouth. So there's a chance of a smooth hound at some point. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to get settled in and uh, start fishing. Well, it's time for the jacket to come off. It's getting warm. Uh, the weather has certainly changed for the better. Um, tomorrow is supposed to be, well, and the rest of the week, it's supposed to be 18 degrees. Um, Tell the weather's warming up. I'm not bringing a flask anymore. I'm back on the Robina. Um, I've already reeled in twice, and uh, they were stripped both times. <clears throat> and I had bottom hooks, just single bottom hooks. So I've changed the right hand rod to a one up, one down. And on the top hook, I'll put a rag and squid wrap. And on the bottom, I'll put squid. Um, just to see if it makes any difference. If that top hook can get away from the crabs. Bloody things. Hopefully. I mean, like I said earlier, um, the hands have started to move in. So maybe they'll have an effect on the crabs and eat them all up for us. Um, because as much as I enjoy fishing, it's not fun just sitting here feeding crabs all day. Um, but I am enjoying it. I'm proper chilled, proper happy. I'm the only one fishing today, uh, unless somebody decides to join me later. There's a few people fishing up the far end, or the bottom end, shall I say, of the pier, but I'm on my own up here. Um, that's just lovely. I'm having another good week. It's getting a bit regular now. I don't want to jinx it. But things are just slotting into place for me. I'm, I'm proper happy at the minute. Proper chilled. Um, my 
mind is calm. It's three times border controls rushed out there. Um, yeah. So I hope you're all well. Hope you're all the same, happy and chilled. Um, I got a new inner tube for Wanda. Uh, in fact, I bought two. I found, because last time I bought one, it was 12 quid. And I found one online where they, there was two of them for 14 quid. So I bought them. But um, I was on the side of the pavement the other day, pumping up my tyre. And this woman rocked up on her scooter, which was a lot bigger than mine. Um, she went, isn't that a pain in the arse? I've done that a few times. I went, yeah, I know. I said, I don't know why they just do them with solid rubber tyres. She went, that's what I've got on mine. I said, have you? She went, yeah. There was a place in Lowestoft did them, but they were 50 quid each. Um, but hers were a lot bigger. Um, but obviously, you know, no punctures, <laughs> ever. So I looked online and I can actually, oh, I've got a bite. Yep. Left hand rod was going. Well, it was definitely a bite. This is one of those Arnold Schwarzenegger grabs. We'll see if it goes again. If it goes again, I'll reel it in. Um, what was the sound? Oh. Oh, yeah, I looked online and I can get the solid rubber tyres for Wanda. Let's go on again. I might get this story out in a minute. <laughs> Let's reel it in. We'll, we'll, we'll come back to what we were talking about, if I remember. Let's see if this is crabs or not. Those bloody crabs, just tugging on it. They give a real pull, like a fish bite. Unbelievable. Right, where's my drink? Right, so, yes. I found solid rubber tyres for Wanda for £17 each. Um, the shipping though was 36 quid. Um, I don't know why they're so much. But anyway, I ain't bought them yet because I had the two the two inner tubes turn up. I thought I'll put them on for now. Um, but as soon as I get a puncture, I'll be it. I'll be getting the hard rubber. Um, 
Not only that, not just because of the punctures. I've got a point on the other one now. Um, but like with all the weight, like there's me plus all the fishing gear, whether I'm carrying it or pulling it on the trailer, um, you know, it's a lot of damn force on inner tubes, whereas the hard rubber tires would be perfect. And there's so much, no matter where you go now, road or pavement, especially pavement, there's glass everywhere. People just get pissed up and just smash the bottles down on the floor, all over town. That's my head in. Um, so yeah. So she's not limping anymore. Uh, and she may be getting an upgrade. <laughs> Wanda's upgrades. I was looking at old Wally the other day, because he's still in my yard. And when I when I when I get to move out of this flat, which I'm hoping to do this year, get a house where there's obviously a garage or a garden with a workshop, you know, shed do all my other hobbies. Um, I'm gonna fix Wally up. Big time. It's good to see him back. All wide, big tires, bigger motor. <laughs> Wheeling down the seafront. Um, so yeah, I'll leave these for 10, 15 minutes and I'll bring you back. Right. Let's check this right hand rod and uh, rebate. Right, that's back out. Totally stripped again. <clears throat> uh, the top up where I had the wrap on, all that was left was the elastic. Ah, oh, they're, they're buggers. It's like they're flying in the water. It doesn't matter where you put the hook, they're getting it. Unreal. Um, <clears throat> I've put ragworm on both. You never know. A bass might come around before the crab get to it. Um, be nice to get my first bass of the year. 
Ah. Uh, but hey -oh. At the minute we're on a, a battle with the pincers. So, we'll see how we get on. I'll bring it back. Well, nothing, guys. Uh, it's now... I forgot my watch. It's now 12 o'clock. Uh, high tide was quarter past 10. But I'm just being stripped every time. Um, we're in dusty bin territory at the minute. Hopefully, before the session's over, I won't have to get out my blankety blank checkbook and pen. Uh, that's not looking good so far. I ain't looking forward to the journey home neither. <laughs> but it is a lovely day and I'm enjoying it. But it would be nice to get a fish. Um, anything to do, you know me? Don't care. We're quiet on the pier today. Um, so I've got the pier to myself. It's lovely. Brett's pier. But like I said, fish or no fish, I'm a better than. Oh, I've got a bite. Was that a grab? That was a good thump. Could have been a grab because they, they pull like that. <laughs> um, yeah, either way, it's better than being in the flat cleaning the kitchen or the bathroom. Talking about that, I did that the other day, you know. Cleaned the bathroom. The walls, everything, right? The bath, the lot. That's got to be a bite. Yeah, that's a bite. You wait to as well. Here we have it guys, nice dogfish, it was actually hard to pull that up, it's got quite, quite a bit of weight to that you know, that's well fat, <laughs> no blank. Well there you go, that's the secret code, you've got to shout out blankety blank checkbook and pen, then your rod will bounce, start bouncing. <laughs> Um, that was that felt quite heavy for the size, and uh, I did struggle to get that over the wall. That's the trouble with the pair, you know. But um, yeah, I'm happy. We didn't blank. 
Sweet. So I've rebaited it. That was with squid on the top hook. So I've rebaited it, got it back out. So I'll, uh, I'll bring it back. Well, I've reeled in two or three more times. <coughs> Same story, stripped. Just a question of being lucky that a, a fish gets there before the crabs do. Basically, that's what you, that's what the gamble is today. Um, but there you go. We do what we can do, can't we? Um, I haven't had any. Ray's turned up. Um, I haven't any bites on the ragworm at all. It's just been on the squid. Um, but I'll keep using them. I'm using rag on the left hand rod and squid on the right. So we'll stick with that for now. Excuse me, I've just had a sandwich. And uh, see how we get on. Good. I like dogfish. One little dog. He was quite big actually. Oh, nice one. Yeah. Eating size. Oh, yeah, he back. was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I ain't got nothing there, Brett. Yeah, I got another bite. Yeah, I know. I've seen it. That's Andy Harry. I must be a good luck uh. <laughs> Come Well, for a little while. That was good old fun. Yeah. All the best guys all Cheers, together. Cheers, mate. Nice and sheltered here, isn't it? Well, for the size of him, he put up quite a, yeah, quite a fight. Quite a fight. Quite a fight. Well, on the end. All the best boys. Little Bobby. Put him back. You over, Michael. Right. Little Bobby. Yeah. Cheers, thanks, bud. You know, I've got a load here. Well, yeah, Ray, what are you scraping off? Well, if they don't come at me, I'm going in Irish. <laughs> Is that the fish or the women? Well, either. It's warm, isn't it? Yeah, that's bad. Warm. I'll never dream of be doing this today, sitting here with Cheryl. No. Oh, well, he's got a couple, you know. Yeah. Bass. What, this side? Yeah, how well. Got, he, no, we got, he think he got a card in the back. Oh, 
Oh, it's got money. Still nothing. Uh, no more bites. The spade stripped. Old uh, Ray just pulled in a nice white now. That's in his box, ready for tea. Bless him. Uh, there's a guy on the end. He's had a couple of nice dogfish. Uh, I've just got squid on all the hooks at the minute. How do you cook your whiting? I do just you fry them. Fry them, yeah? Yeah, simply, I don't make them very well. No? I don't need any fish, I just, you know, put them on the cook and that's it. Bit of flour on them. Been them dogfish, while well, we take the big ones I got yesterday, were unbelievable. They're hard to skin, though, aren't they? Well, they're hard to skin. You know, the, the lumps of meat off them. And I've done them little chaps, had me put some batter on them and a little spicy batter and fry them like nuggets. Yeah. They, they taste all right. Huh? I, mean, I got four big in Monday. Yeah. It's all about two, three pounds. A big bucket, they were. Good. Then I went down the quayside the next day, Monday, I down bend down Monday, got through. I couldn't eat, I couldn't eat them a lot, I was not, you know, I couldn't eat them meal out of meal, isn't it? Yeah. Wow. Well. They're, they're a bit peculiar thing. You pretending again? They, them crabs pull well, don't they? Yeah. I really sit that egg on. Well done. Well done. There we go. There we go, guys. 
You never know, Stogie. Fresh and everybody look good. And beautiful condition. Chip shop, you'd get as rock. Rock Yeah. Rock salmon. Rock salmon. Yeah. Uh, that is a. Dogfish. Dogfish. Yeah. 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 Three nice ones you got then. It is. Well, there we go, guys. Dogfish number three. Um, yeah. Turn into a night session. In fact, I think I've got another bite. Um, that was on a squid and. Um, uh, rag wrap the top book. Yeah, I've got another bite. Not this time. Yeah, so as I was saying, three nice dogfish. I literally just cast that back out and I started bouncing, but that must have been crabs. Oh, they're really pulling hard. Either that or something was just pulling at it and I missed it. Um, so, uh, but yeah, so we we'll, we'll got it back out, squid on. Oh. Hold on. Right, 
They look too good for crab bites. They do, mate. I, I really agree. Do. I totally agree. Pull on these crabs is phenomenal. That was bouncing like I had a bass on the end of that. Either that or just missed it, but I don't know. But that's twice now. And the second that got to the bottom, that was boom, boom, boom. Uh, might leave it two or three seconds longer. But that was going for ages that time. That's coming again. Oh, left hand. Dogfish number four. Only a little bubby, but got his eyes wide open. This one, he's giving me the evils. <laughs> Put him back. What do you say, buddy? Thank you very much. You're lagging behind today. What's going on? Yeah. I'm out of, I'm out of big stuff. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh, right, okay. <laughs> Ticket right there, right? Feast of the day coming up. Oh, look at that. How can that be bloody crab? What? Ray's getting mad. 
Yeah, don't think that matter. They're just going to keep cutting your line and running off with your bait. Yeah, yeah they just uh, come on, done. Got out of the clip. Ray's being hammered by the crabs. But they are pulling, like I say, I mean, it looked like a bass bite, what he just had there. Unbelievable. Crabs on steroids. <laughs> Little session. Four dogfish. What's the time? Look at her. Too young for me. Four past two. Um, I don't know what time we're going to fish till three. Or we'll see how it goes. But while the fish are biting, I'll keep fighting. Huh? <laughs> uh, what have I just I've just rebaited with a rag, squid wrap, and then just rag on the bottom hook. Um, See how we get on. Bring you right back, boy. <coughs> hey, doggy for Ray. You got past the crabs, boy. That's the one he's been laughing all over his chops. Any? <laughs> Geronimo. All right, guys, I've been here a few hours now. Bites have slowed right up. I packed one right away. Uh, the one with a single hook. Just look at the one up, one down out there. Just cast out. Fresh bit of squid on. I'm out of uh, rag now. Um, I'll say it's the last cast. But if I do get a bite, it might be another cast. So uh, we'll see how it goes. But either way, I've had an awesome day. Um, you in? Is it? Hang on, let's see what Ray's got. Must be a bigger crab. <sighs> Have a doggy. Well done. That's me done. Uh, been here six hours. Uh, Stop biting now. Um, but I've had a good day. I've had a good day. So thanks for watching, guys. Uh, give us a little thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Leave me a little comment, you know what I mean. And uh, I'll see you on the next one. Tight lines, calm minds, take care.
کرد.